As the Baltimore food scene continues to expand, another culinary reinvention is happening downtown with the opening of Ida B's Table. And with me now is chef and partner David Thomas. David, welcome to you, sir. Thanks for being here. Thank you for having me. What are we doing today for the viewers? What are we cooking up here? Today, I'm going to do my version of shrimp and grits. Uh, oh. That's a little different um, with our spin on what we call modern soul food. Instead of using a traditional hominy grits, I'm using some yellow cornmeal polenta. So that's what we're going to be using today. Well, I'm excited to see this, and I know the okay. people at home are too, and so we'll get the dish started right, here. We'll get started. And while we do so, I have to ask you, well, what was the inspiration for you to open up uh, Ida B's? Well, um, I owned two restaurants prior uh, called Urban Soul, and it's kind of an extension of what I was doing there. I focus on, you know, local ingredients, um, using the most sustainable products possible, you know, being, uh, you know, very kind of progressive in my thoughts on how food should be. And then pairing that with the Real News Network, they sought me out to kind of open a restaurant in the space that they already had. So um, they're a network, um, they focus on news, and they wanted something that made sense to tie in the restaurant with their organization. So um, Ida B. Wells was a perfect candidate, and that's why it's called Ida B's Table. Yep. Got some nice spice on the shrimp yeah. there, I see. I can s uh, smell the fragrance. Oh, yeah. Uh. So we're using head-on shrimp. These are uh, sourced sustainably. I think they're a great shrimp. They're a nice flavor. And you can actually suck the heads on these once we get them all oh, done. Oh, so come on now. Great, great. Now you're, now you're so we'll talking. let those go. <laughs> um, while they're working, I'll uh, get working on the grits here as well. You're, you're located down there, just off uh, Saratoga, downtown in mm -hmm. Baltimore. Yep. And, and uh, I have to ask you, I know you're, one of your slogans, one of your spins is modern soul food. Mm -hmm. what, what do you mean by modern soul food? Well, I mean, for me, you know, soul food has never been giving really, uh, given the, looked at in the best light. You know, it's, it's always tastes great, mm -hmm. um, but it has never really looked as good as, you know, some of the other cuisines, most notably French food, how it's very stylish. So what I wanted to do, since I'm classically trained, is to kind of give a spin to uh, what soul food could be. Using those same ingredients, maybe a touch different, as opposed to using regular grits, we're using the polenta, um, but just doing something a little differently. So I think you'll be able to see that in our final product here. Well, it looks beautiful right now. You got Good. the vegetables in there, you got the yeah. shrimp. Now we're putting the grits in the boiling water, correct? Yep, All so right. we're just gonna get those working. And I like them to be a little stiff, you know, a nice texture in them, mm -hmm. yeah, because you want the grits, you don't want them really runny. So we're gonna get them in, let them work. You're making me hungry, Chef. I'm telling you, the, 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 the smells, the fragrance is really good. Is this, this has to be, and I know you've already had, you've been open a short while, just a uh -huh. couple of weeks. Um, you've had some, some favorite dishes already. I'm guessing this might be one of them. Uh, yeah, I mean, us. this is one of the popular ones. This, we do uh, a chicken and waffle, and our version of that is done with uh, a sweet potato waffle, and then we do a um, infused rosemary into the syrup, and we use pasture-raised chicken. Mm. Um, so, yeah, it's... Uh, we have a couple dishes that are, you know, kind of outpacing the rest, but I think given time, as people see more of the items that we do, um, you know, other items will pick up in sales as well. So yeah. add a little bit more blackened seasoning. Okay, Hit that with a little up. sugar, mm -hmm. a little salt, a little pepper. Then we're going to deglaze it with a little white wine here. All right. We're going to turn that down. All right. Okay. Lots of little smoke going to come up. Okay. Almost to the dramatic plating up here, Chef. We've got about uh, <laughs> half a minute to a minute. Yeah, so. we're almost there. All righty. You hit that with a little heavy cream. Mm. Add in the rest of those vegetables. A little fresh Parmesan Reggiano there. Okay. And while that sets up, we're going right. to go ahead and get our grits Put our on grits the plate. down. Yep. All righty. Those grits look perfect. That look at that texture, that consistency. That's what you want, yeah. right? Yeah, you still want them a little gritty, a little mm -hmm. texture. Okay, let those set. All right. It's about there. Then we're gonna take our shrimp. Lay the shrimp in. And now we go with the finale here. And we'll show a shot of that. And again, for everyone watching, it is Ida B's uh, in downtown Baltimore. Uh, you guys are, are open and ready for business, we and you need to check them out. The food is fantastic at Ida B's. Chef, thank you so much for coming in. David Thomas, we appreciate you being here. Appreciate you. I think we're going to be enjoying some real nice food here very shortly in the studio. <laughs> we'll be back with more Midday Maryland right after this. Stay with us.
Beautiful.